Hola YouTube, seguimos con Tales from the Borderlands, segundo episodio, tercera parte y vamos a ver qué les ha sucedido a las chicas eh, mientras nosotros estábamos en el desierto eso está siendo muy interesante, muy divertido, así que no os lo perdáis ¡Venga, dale, Manolo! Ay, Dios mío Sí, realmente con el bot cargador a lo mejor no era necesario ir a Hollow Point, pero bueno Ahora supongo que veremos lo que hacen Sasha y Fiona en el coche. Oye, y, y estará el August ahí, ¿no? El ex novio de Sasha. I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. Oh, please. This is me doing this. Nothing I can't handle. Okay, don't get too cocky. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. Wouldn't have it any other way. Bueno, pues aquí estamos. No, 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 no. Una radio. Vamos a apagar la música porque es horrible. No podemos apagar la música, sí. Calendario pin-up. Does every mechanic have to be gross? A mí me parece que es arte. Aquí hay algo, contenedor de botín. Dinerito. Leaving me out like this. I almost feel sorry for the poor sap. Almost. I carry this three to five by twelve. Oh, what the hell, man? I gotta cut down my wrench budget. Oh, oh hey, man. Welcome to Skitter's Catch a Ride. What can we do for you today? Scooter. Le encantan los coches, las mujeres y los coches. <laughs> uh... Sorry if I seem a little dis distracted. Uh, hopefully, handing this place over to the new proprietor today, and I gotta get all these numbers and stuff in order. No, it's a lot. I don't know if you know this, but the transition from small business owner to franchise owner is. Wow, this is a really nice looking place you have here, Scooter. Oh, thanks, man. It means a lot. Business has been a little slow so far, you know, being in a hidden cave town and everything, but it'll pick up. <laughs> Hope it picks up, though. Holy crap! I knew I recognized this rig from somewhere. You were in the latest Boston Over Death Rally. Oh, I was there, man! Did you see me? I was, I was waving. You were a badass! Oh, <laughs> yep, got me. That thing's beat up to hell and back, man. I can fix it, but it's probably gonna run you about 2,500 cold 2,500? Uh, that's a little out of my price range. Not to be implied or nothing, but you must have won a buttload of money from that race, right? Where did it all go? Oh, cause my cousin, right? He said that his sister's friend's neighbor's husband won one of them races one time and the cats kept them fed for weeks. Yeah. Someone stole it. Can you believe that? Yes, actually. Yes, I can. Well, tell me this. You think you could ever see yourself racing again? 
Let me pitch you some, and it might be crazy, but if you keep racing, I would love to endorse you as a sponsor. What do you say? It'll be great, maybe like a billboard, a couple commercials, product placement. You'd be huge. Tell you what. Throw in an extra thousand bucks and you've oh, got man. yourself a deal. Como no era, de wow, man, that's kind of a hard bargain, don't you think? Call it a signing bonus. Uh, I, I don't know, man. That kind of thing makes me a little uncomfortable. Say it once for me, man, you know? The catchphrase. Dile una vez el eslogan. Catch a ride. You know it. Come on. Don't be shy. I'm your sponsor now. Conserva la dignidad o venderse totalmente. Go on, do it. Catch a ride. Catch a ride. Hmm. Okay, okay. Thousand bucks. Of course, but you're going to have to win like a crap load of races, all right? La dignidad no, no es necesaria cuando nos estamos jugando la supervivencia. Add on your van, you know, like maybe a picture of me with like Catch a ride up above it, you know, all cool, right? I'm looking all badass. You need to put some badass pictures of you with your car and your hat and all that. Hi, Scooter, right? <laughs> Creo que se enamora. Everything going okay? <laughs> I was, uh, I was just gonna, you know, go grab the paperwork. Let me take care of that. Okay, <laughs> bye. Mujeres y pagafantas. Right, my standard endorsement contract. Don't mind the sub clauses about explosions or whatnot. I might have copied it from Torg. Anyway, I figure as long as I'm in there and you're doing it free, maybe you want to splurge and get some of the special packages. I got some good ones. And don't tell me you're broke because I know you got that extra thousand I just gave you. Ah, mira, pues, qué guay. A ver, ajustes de fábrica, el paquete de caravana más normal para quien no le gusta ostentar. Autoafirmación menos 100%, riesgo de robo 0%. Trabuco de hierro. Disfruta de ese clásico con Jacobs junto a tu familia o clan de bandidos. Con su madera de limpieza fácil, el trabuco de hierro es perfecto para acampar en territorio enemigo para pedir todo un banquete a domicilio. Ostentación dorada, clase más 100. Otras mejoras. Copa de borgoña opcional si bebes no conduzcas. Este modelo fusiona el error de... Atropellar animales, sí, pero siempre con elegancia. Cilindro, longitud de mostacho. Color, más 20%. Cambiaron cualquier conducta se morirá en vida por esta caravana con estilo que arde. La pintura especial piromana que me desde el trabajo de mañana. Pero esto es tonterías, ¿no? Me imagino. Uy. Especial de scooter, realizado a mano por un artesano local. Convierte tu caravana en una obra de arte única. 1550 pavos. Hombre, tenemos pavos, pero... ¿Vosotros creéis que merece la pena? ¿O guardamos el dinero para algo especial más adelante? ¿Eh? Ay, no sé, no sé. Dudo entre el este y el especial de Scooter. Ah, voy a quedar en el especial. Actually, I think we'll just take her back to the factory settings. Save the extra cash. Ah, no problem, no problem. We can just stick with the basics. Don't blame me when you're missing that flat, though. Come on in, man. We'll get her all hooked up and get to work. ¿Y estos? Oh, crap. This doesn't look good. Hey, fellas, what can I do you for? Oh, no. Yeah. I just hope that little deal you two struck is enough to get him to look the other way. <laughs> oh, we're blown. 
We are totally screwed. Oh, that's great positive thinking, Fiona. Joder. Pobre Scooter. Ahora me da, me da pena no habernos gastado unos dineritos en él. Hope you ladies weren't too scared. Just doing my duty to keep ruffians the crap out of my garage. I'm a real protector type. Who were those guys? Man, just some wannabe tough guys trying to shake down a local business owner. You know how it is. Yeah, they looked pretty dangerous to me. Yeah, they probably could have killed me, but I look death in the face a lot. Like all the time. Like, hey, death, how you doing? No big deal. <laughs> Seems like there's some bad men looking for you two, though. You got a place to lay low while I'm getting your ride all fixed up? I don't think Felix is as too far away. If we're careful, we can make it on foot. Then, let's do it. Al menos no nos han... No sé por qué discuten a acabar delatándonos. Se da cuenta de que puede ganar más dinero delatándonos que, que con las carreras estas misteriosas. We shouldn't hang around here too long. Looks like he had company while he was away. Hopefully they didn't find the stash. Come on, look around. We gotta be in and out. Yeah. I got the door. Pues vamos a mirar el panel, a ver qué cosas hay. Estantería. Felix sure was into science fiction. Me está claro que la puerta es aquí, pero vamos a mirar antes estas cosas. Quizá había dinero. It's empty. That's strange. The can's wet, but I don't see any paint. Hmm. Weird. La radio, no vamos a poner musiquita. I had to force this on him once his eyesight was starting to go. Yeah, stubborn as always. I couldn't even get him to stop using floppy disks. <laughs> floppy disks, eso sí que está pasado de moda. Who is she? I don't know. They look happy, though. Yeah, those floppy disks. Felix's favorite chair. Those few times he felt he could relax, anyways. A comfort directly proportional to its wear. Eso dicen. Granada casera. Nunca viene mal. Excelente. Y no hay nada más, ¿no? Parece. Pues vamos a abrir aquí el panel este. Y vámonos a la lijo secreta de Félix. Always nice to see an old friend. No hay nada. Great. A flashlight. Maybe if we go camping. It's a black light. It's the one Felix used to check our first counterfeit bills. Oh. Looks familiar. It's hard to believe that asshole would be sentimental enough to keep this in his safe. Not unless he meant for us to find it. Vamos a cogerlo, pues. Interna ultravioleta. Más granadas caseras. Mapa que no. A lo mejor podemos usar esto con eso que estaba pensando con la ley. Sasha, look at this. What the hell? It's ultraviolet paint. 
I guess he wanted to keep all this a secret. Well, he left this for us to find, so there's something he wanted us to see. Caliente pone. Ah, I see it right there. Awesome. Pues a empujar a la sillita de los huevos. Uh, if you find another flashlight under there, I'm leaving. <laughs> Guess that's what we're searching for, huh? Guess so. Here we go. Better double check the contents. No te alejes de la puerta que va a entrar alguien malo. Entrará Augustus, este, el exnovio de Sasha. Ya verás. Lo veo. Ah, mira, dinerito. Oh, hello, sexy. You're coming with me. ¿Dónde Solo un montón de dinero. Ah, vale. Más granadas caseras, ya tenemos tres. Oh, tío. Y... Comunicador eco. What is it? It's an echo call. Why is there... If you're seeing this, I suppose I'm either dead or worse. My plan worked. I'm sorry. Fiona. Sasha, there's so much I want to tell you, but the less you know, the better. Oh, give me a break. Halfway through the con, I realized we were messing with Valerie's people. I knew that, and I never revealed it to you two. Well, if you're watching this, it won't be long before she's coming after you. Change your names. Change your appearance. Change your life. Valerie? Do you know that name? Forget about the life you had, and forget about me. But know that I love you both with all my heart. I'm sorry. What are you sorry for? You're not the one that left. The one that lied. I'm not gonna listen to another second of his bullshit. What was it you yelled at him? Choke on it. What does that even mean? I don't know. Choke on the money, I guess. I, I was just pissed. It was always about the money. The second a big score showed up, he betrayed us. We had it. We had it in our hands, Fiona. Ten million dollars. Enough to get off this planet. Enough to, to buy a new life. Felix may be gone. But I'm still here for you. I know. First we find that vault. After that, the rest will take care of itself. Well, I hope you're right. You want a sandwich? It might be a while before we eat again. Sure. Caja de regalo. A ver qué hay. F de Fiona. What is it? It's some sort of an upgrade. Still only holds a single shot, but it looks like it adds an elemental effect to the bullet. It looks like a backup plan. O sea que ahora tenemos dos disparos, ¿no? Porque o oh, sigue siendo de una sola. Hmm, this one comes with another shot. Now I've got two bullets. Viva. Se lo damos o no? Sí, ¿no? Mostrar respeto.
He left you something, too. I don't want it. Come on, don't be like that. Don't tell me how to feel. I'll just hold on to it for you. In case you change your mind. I won't. So stubborn. Oops. Are you really gonna turn down a dead man's final gift to me? Claro, el mostachos. Cold blooded. Y Finch, no le digas nada del pelo. Right. You should be ashamed of yourself. Hands up, both of you. What you making? Sandwich. Nice hair. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? It means your hair is nice. I will shoot you in the face right now if you talk Whoa, shit. Finch, calm down, man. Don't talk about his hair. Huh? He's good. Ah. Ay. Ah, ah. Tengo dos balas y hay dos malos. No digo más. You heard me going up. You see me looking at you. Make him shoot through that nice floor. And for what? For nothing. You two got every bounty hunter in Pandora looking for you, and you're making a sandwich? Tire up. Let's get out of here. Ooh, this cheese fast. Please, you embarrassing yourself. Go on. Fiona, shoot him. Do it. You're pointing that at a dude who has people shoot him in the chest for fun. I'm usually drunk. And charge 40 bucks, but you can have this one for free. Go on, I won't even cringe. You all right, man? Oh, yeah, real, real good. <laughs> I love it. You don't have to be a tough guy about it, it's cool. <laughs> Hey, man. Hey! Go! Destrozan mis perros. Dispárale, coño. Cogen la pistola, le pegas un tiro y se acaba. ¿Esto? Esta es la, la, la asesina. La asesina que no hace. Odiarla. Esa es la que quería matar a Polus. You heard wrong. Oops. Corre, primo, corre. Fiona, over there. How do you like this? Qué apropiado el escudo. Sasha, that's enough. Let's go. Fiona, no, wait. Es el Capitán América. This way. Eh, por allá. Hey, wait up. Uy. Que es como para ese furgoneta, la para con el pecho, cuidado. Ay, ay, ay. Pero pégale una patada en la boca. Ay, cuidado con esta. Shut up. She's still back there. 
Can't see her. Better. Are you sure? Maybe she's on the rooftop. I can't. Ah, look out! Pero atropellala, coño La atropellas y que le den por culo Ay, Dios mío This ends now You think some stupid Hyperion motorbike gonna be out? Jajaja, tomar por That doesn't sound right Motorbots can't do that Look, were you there? No, you weren't That's what happened Go on Adiós, Antena, Atena, o... Ah. Was she bothering you? Yeah, you probably should have asked that before you threw her halfway across town. Oh, man. Did you see the look on her face? Where's Reese and Bon? Scooter's garage. They sent me to get you. Oh, well, that's nice of them. What? Al final, ha sido una buena decisión no de ir a buscarle. Ah, ¿habéis visto? Come with me, you wanna listen lo que dicen en Terminator. En Terminator 2. Bueno, pues al final hemos conseguido reunirnos sin ningún problema, así que todo va bien. En fin, vamos a ver, ya estamos todos reunidos, ya podemos ir a Old Haven todos juntos y ver qué sucede en la, en la última parte de este segundo episodio. Así que nada, espero que os esté molando tanto como a mí, dadle un like, suscribíos que es gratis y nos vemos en el siguiente vídeo. Adiós.